I finally get to meet Chad's parents, but I don't know what I'm gonna wear. How about you wear your prom dress? They've probably never seen that. Uh, hello? I don't think that's gonna fit. <laughs> oh yeah, what was I thinking? Did they know about the baby yet? Oh yeah, they're so excited about becoming grandparents. And they keep suggesting names. <laughs> names? I thought you didn't know if it was a boy or girl yet. <laughs> that's right, so maybe I should buy a dress that's pink and blue to cover both bases. Where should we go to get one? I don't know, I usually shop juniors. What kind of place does a mom go? Well, my mom shops at Bergstrom's. Ooh, I heard a lot of celebrities go there. <laughs> Come on, it's right at this end of the mall. Why are we going to Bergstrom's anyway? <sighs> because they have the hot new stuff. But that's where old ladies shop. <sighs> Bergstrom's isn't your mother's department store anymore. Really? Since when? Haven't you seen it on social media lately? That's where all the hottest stars get their looks now. All right, let's check it out. Wow. So what do you think? I think we need more stores like this. Good afternoon, girls. Welcome to Burstrom's. This place is so different than I remember. Well, even though Burstrom's been around for 98 years, we are really changing with the times. Yeah, we see your clothes all over social media. Where can I try some of this on? Well, pick out the styles you like and I'll hold them for you in the dressing room. Oh, wow. I think this would really impress them. Uh, looks expensive. <sighs> I hope Chad has a lot of money. Or hopefully a lot of room on his credit card. <gasps> Great. Now I gotta wait on kids? Can I help you too? Oh, uh, we're just looking. Have you two thought about looking in our clearance section downstairs? <laughs> well, my friend here needs a new dress. Yeah, I'm meeting my in-laws for the first time. Well, do you have a Bergstrom's account? Because this is our designer collection. Oh, designer. I love nice things. Wait a minute, that's the dress. Didn't Dua Lipa wear this to the oh, Grammys? Yeah, and I saw Kendall Jenner on a cover of a magazine with this one. Please don't touch the merchandise unless you can pay for it. Uh, she can afford it. What's her deal anyway? Olivia doesn't want to wait on younger customers because she knows that only older ones have money. Oh, this is nice and loose fitting. <laughs> yeah, yellow is really your color. <laughs> Excuse me, young ladies. I have some important business to take care of. Ding dong, the Karen's gone. Yeah, I thought she'd never leave. Hello. Welcome to Bergstrom's. Oh, hi. I don't usually shop here. Oh, really? To what do we owe this pleasure today? To be honest, I felt your clothes were a little on the ordinary side. I usually shop at Goldman's. Oh, really? What is it about the Goldman's experience that pleases you so much? Well, I have my own personal shopper there who gets to know me and helps build my wardrobe. Oh, really? Well, we can do that and more. More? How can that be? Well, after all, Bergstrom's is where the celebrities shop. Celebrities, count me in. Well, it's this way. Oh, crap. How do you feel about this teal color? I love that. I'm kind yeah. of in love with it. Yeah, yeah okay, fantastic. I'm definitely trying that on. I'm thinking about pairing these kind of edgy. Oh, you have to, that's right? a look. Yes. yes. I, could definitely... I think it could work. I could see you making yes. that okay, work. I have you to pull try miracles that with clothes. <laughs> How do you feel about pearl necklines? Hmm, I'd have, ooh. Embellishments, you know? I feel like it's classy, but it's yeah. not over the top. I think I might copy you a little bit, because this, <gasps> that would look really good on you. I love the I neckline. I think so, yeah. So girls, are you finding anything you like? Oh yes, quite a bit. <laughs> I think we're ready to try it on. <laughs> okay, shoppers, right this way. Leather coats are on sale. I think this is my size. Huh. I'm sure they don't have one that fits me. Well, maybe you could ask that sales lady if they have any more of these. 
I think I'd rather go without than deal with her. Right this way. Ooh, and I want to try this one on too. And I want to try on all of these. Let's just start with what you selected and then we can try everything else on. I have two dressing rooms for you right over here. And if you have any questions, I'll be right here. Alicia's customers are showing an interest in a lot of clothing. Will they be able to afford them? And may I present to you our celebrities collection. Now that's more my style. In fact, Dua Jenner wore this to an award show. Wow, and it looks like my size. And you might recognize this one. Kendall Lipa wore it in a magazine cover. This is absolutely perfect for my daughter. Olivia Brown, please call the office. Would you excuse me for a moment? Okay. Olivia, you have the lowest sales of any of the Bergstrom Associates at this location. I know I haven't been making sales, but the spring fashion line just came in. You haven't been providing the kind of service we expect. You need to treat all customers the same and not just the older ones. Listen, you know me. If it's on the rack, it's going to get sold. You can't manage to help the young customers as well. Then I'll find someone who can. I love this jacket. It would go perfect with that celebrity dress. Oh, let me go get it. Oh, no, 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 no. Alicia Summers. Please call the office. Girls, I have to take care of something. I'll be right back. Hi, I was paged to call in. Alicia, I'm quite impressed with the results that I'm seeing since you started here. Oh, thank you, Mrs. Collins. You know, I feel like a lot of the staff is ignoring the young customer base. Yes, we've invested a lot in inventory that seems to do well with the aspirational young customer. You're right. A lot of our new customers are saying that they see our designs being worn by celebrities on social media. Isn't it great? It's like free advertising. Well, whatever you're doing, please bring in more designs like that. Well, I'll be sure to tell headquarters what you said. Why, thank you. And I really enjoy working here. Well, hopefully we get more salespeople just like you. Do you think this is stretchy enough? <laughs> it's bold. There you two are. Uh-oh, look who's back. Where are the dresses? Dresses? <laughs> They're here, over there, everywhere. This is a department store. I'm not talking about these. I'm talking about the Jenna Leaper dresses. Where did you hide those? Jenna Leaper? We don't have any of your dresses. Oh, really? Are you sure they're not in one of those bags? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. Why don't you look at my pack? Clearly they're not in here. Where did you put them? Uh, nowhere. Yeah, did you check that other lady? She seemed kind of sneaky. Mrs. Marcus? <laughs> She's one of our best customers. Best customer or not, why don't you look in her bag? Yeah, and stop bothering us. You know what? Let's all go to the security office and straighten this out. Fine, whatever. Alicia Summers. We have some missing dresses from the celebrity line. Really? Could it be your customers? No, it's not my customers. Well, can you see if they're carrying any large bags just in case? Fine, I'll check anyway. Okay, thanks. The celebrity dresses are missing. Is it Olivia's customers or Alicia's? Girls, how are we doing? Fine. <laughs> yeah, I love this. Me too, I'm definitely buying this. <laughs> I hate to bother you, but we've had an incident in the store. Incident? What's wrong? Well, we have some designer items missing and they're making us check in with all the customers. 
Oh my, what can we do to help? Nothing really. Wait, you two didn't bring any backpacks or large purses with you, did you? No. Why, are they on sale? Oh no, it has nothing to do with that. Go ahead and try the rest of your clothes on. You two, wait over there. I'm going to get security. Uh, what are you doing over here? Oh, I was just trying this on. <laughs> oh, really? You know what? I'm just gonna wait here for that sales lady. What is this about some stolen dresses? Yes, they're very expensive and one of these girls took them. Well, in that case, I'm gonna need to look in all of your bags. I already looked through them. They must have put them somewhere else. Well, regardless, I'm going to need to check her bag just to be safe. You didn't check her. What? What do I have to do with this? She's right. She's a great customer. This is not about her. It's not me. It's her. She's obviously fake pregnant. Really? You think I'm hiding clothes in here? Now take a look at what's in this. Well, I guess we found our thief. We have a special place to lock up people like you. hit the showers. No, you need to stay behind. We need to work on a fitness routine. I'm already doing all I can. Look, our cheerleaders are slim and trim. I expect you to be the same. There's nothing wrong with my cheer. I'm doing just as good, if not better, than the other girls. All right, go hit the treadmill and we'll see how you do tomorrow. Okay, you're the coach. Oh, finally, more pizza. Thought we were gonna run out. Boy, you're hungry. I've never seen you eat this much. Did you skip breakfast? No, I had two omelets and a stack of blueberry pancakes, my favorite. The coat is gonna be mad at you. Are you okay? Maybe it's stress eating. Uh, no, I'm eating for two. Oh, is your boyfriend fasting or something? Oh, no, 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 he's having a baby. Men can't have babies. <laughs> no, silly. He's having a baby with me. Wow! Well, that's so exciting. Is it safe to cheer? Haven't you read Dr. Brock? Dr. Brock? Who's he? Hello? Why do you think they call our school Brock University? He's the world's biggest expert on babies. Oh, I saw his statue in front of the administration building. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize that was him. No, we know. For girls like me, it's okay to have physical activity early in the pregnancy. Oh, good. I was worried. <laughs> Waiter, more pizza over here for her. <laughs> All right, that was pretty good. Oh my, Ashley, you're bigger than yesterday. What are you storing food in there for the winter? Are you gonna be a problem around here? Coach, I need to talk to you about something. Is there somewhere private we can go? Fine. I was gonna get a cup of coffee anyway, come with me. Here, I brought you a cup. Oh no, I can't have caffeine right now. Right now? What's going on? Well, you've read Dr. Brock's book, no doubt. You're not supposed to have coffee. Dr. Brock, the founder of our university? He's talking about pregnant women. Well, that's what I'm talking about. I'm having a baby. Oh, that explains it. But don't worry, I can still do cheer. Well, that's not up to you now, is it? What are you saying? Last time I checked, I was coach. I decide who's on the squad and who's off. What? I can't be off the team. I do a great job. Look, we can't have a pregnant cheerleader here at Brock University. What kind of message does that send to alumni and other students? This isn't the 1900s. Pregnant women have rights too. Not on my squad. Now go clean out your locker. You're gonna regret this. Well, girls? That's it. Huh? I'm off the squad. Just like that. She can't do that. That's right. Well, she's the coach. I can't force her to keep me. I can't do this without you. Yeah, we should all quit. You can't quit. 
You can make more of a difference on the team than off. People need to know about this. We need to make a video. Yeah, if people knew what was going on, the school would have to respond. Ashley, I'm ready when you are. Until today, I was cheer captain at Brock University. And now, I'm no longer part of the cheer team because I'm pregnant. And the coach said she can kick someone off her team for any reason or no reason at all. Dean Kepler. Sir, you better check the news. We're getting bad publicity. I'll look into it. Dean Kepler. Bob Johnstone, Channel 7 News. We need a comment on this pregnancy story. No, I'm not making any comments to the press. Dean Kepler. There's an important call on line two. You're gonna wanna take this. You know what? Hold all my calls, we have a crisis. You don't understand, this is Dr. Brock himself, and he is angry. Girls, keep cheering, you look really disorganized. We're just not the same without a captain. Yeah, yeah we want Ashley back. Well, she's not coming back, and I don't want to see you three slacking anymore. What are we supposed to do now? I don't know. Look who's here. Do you guys need a fort? She's back! She's so crazy. Let's give this crowd a growl they'll never forget. We are the Tigers. Red, black, and white. We are back as one. What do you think you're doing? We're cheering. Yeah, that's what we're supposed to do. Not with her on the team, you're not. Oh, really? Have you looked at social media lately? Yeah, everybody wants her here. The only thing that matters is what I want. Well, you know what? Maybe we'll quit this team. Well, maybe it would be easier to have you all kicked out of Brock University. How are you going to do that? <laughs> that's easy. The Dean recruited me. He'll do what I say. Well, why don't we ask him? Because here he is, now. Good to see you girls. Coach Williams, I need to speak with you, now. Dean Kepler, of course. Look, if this is about the pregnant cheerleader, I can explain. I kicked her off the squad. She came back completely unauthorized. You kicked her off the squad? What for? Look at her, she's pregnant. You're aware that our founder is the most famous baby doctor of all time? Of course I am. I'm very sensitive to this issue. He made it very clear to me that in his book, it's quite appropriate for someone who is physically active to stay active during early pregnancy. Well, he may be right, but we can't have somebody like that parading around during our sporting events. Well, he feels completely the opposite. Okay. I mean, do you want me to let her back on the team? No, that won't be necessary. So, it'll be my call. Well, actually, it's not your call. Because you're fired. What? You can't do that! Oh yes, I can. And I just did. 